Oh, great, guys. And just what we needed as it's about to go dark. A freaking Seeger. Oh, that was that was surprisingly easy. I was I was about to get all triggered and rage out on this thing, and uh, it just died. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? CJ the Cheese DJ here, and we are back, guys, with a brand new series for you guys today. And today, guys, we are taking on the arcs. So we'll be doing the story arcs, guys. We'll be going from the island through to Scorched Earth through to Aberration, through to Extinction, through to Genesis, yeah. And then hopefully Genesis Part 2. And hopefully, I mean, that should drop by the time we finish all these, because this is going to take us a hell of a long time. But guys, the goal is to pretty much, uh, we're going to try and do these in the fastest way possible. So that's going to entail us pretty much going out and uh, killing a bunch of dudes and whatnot. We're going to start at West 2. We have wiped the map. I don't know why our survival was still alive. Uh, we do have a whole bunch of different settings and whatnot. Uh, I'll give you a quick rundown of them as we go through as well. Let's just real quick crank the uh, bloom quality down. Oh, there we go. We can see. I did not miss that. Alrighty, guys. So like I said, we're going to be going through all the arcs and uh, hopefully we can uh, we can do them pretty quickly. Now, gather rates are times three. Uh, XP rates are times three. And what else was there? Gather, harvest. Oh, taming. Taming is times three as well. We wanted it to be uh, not too grindy, but a little bit grindy, if that makes sense. So that's why we've gone for the times three. And uh, yeah, I I have not remembered what it's like starting in an arc world in a very long time. I'm going to grab some berries here. We're going to grab the explorer notes located precariously around this place. Hopefully we can dodge any, any suspecting raptors that are waiting for us. Hiding around. Sweet. There we go. Oh, that was a times four one. Awesome. So we're going to grab that. We're just going to go about harvesting a bunch of stuff. You guys know what the uh, the standard old starting arc is like. It's uh, it's quite a grind. We're just trying to remember where the next explorer node is. I know there's one down there. I know there's one over that way. And I know there's one on top of that hill. I can't remember if there's one on top of this hill. It has been a hell of a long time since I've had to do a note run. We want to stay away from anything dangerous. Uh, our difficulty setting is set to the max, so the dinos should be max level 150. We're going to come up here and check just to make sure. Level 14. Okay, something's not right. I don't know why it doesn't work. We're going to have to change that. Uh, but the max level dino difficulty is going to be 150. We've already got 10 levels. We're going to go a couple into stam, a uh, couple into health, and then probably weight. Oh, no. Uh, all standard engram points, all standard weight level ups. We've got no mods, nothing like that. This is just going to be a pure vanilla uh, run through. It. Aside from like obviously the, uh, aside from the, uh, the the multipliers, but nonetheless, that's still going to be, still going to be. It's not going to be a, like anything broken or anything like that. We're going to come down to the water here, get some water. Uh, so far, things are looking pretty good. There's been nothing too hostile. I'm, I'm digging that. I can appreciate nothing trying to kill us right now, which is wonderful. We are going to need some water, and it is so damn bright. Holy smokes. Let's gamma down. Is that going to... Oh, man. I, 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 I just can't... Like, I just forgot how glary the island map was. So, guys, for this one, we're going to need to take on the dragon. We're going to need to take on the broodmother. We're going to need to take on the megapithecus. And then we're going to have to ascend. Now, I can't, I'm pretty sure we need one tier of each trophy to ascend. I don't think I've ever actually legitimately ascended either. So this is going to be interesting. We'll grab this explorer note. I don't think they're going to pop up because we have already gathered them. Um, we are going to need to change the dinosaur settings. This guy's only level 28. So something's gone funky uh, along the way. Let's grab some more levels in health. Uh, we'll grab some more in stamina and we'll grab movement speed. Always got to grab movement speed. But like I said... Stats are completely vanilla. There are no extra stats. And that goes the same for our dinos. So dinos aren't even getting leveled up extra or anything like that. They're still all the same stats as a raptor over there. We're going to stay the hell away from him. But right now we're just trying to grab some levels because we need levels to start off arc. And uh, yeah, it's been quite a long time since I've had to do such a start. So guys, if you find yourselves enjoying the video, please... Leave a like. It really, oh shit, this is bad. Really helps. Oh, that is very bad. These pigos. It's a true don. Oh shit, we're dead. Well, it had to happen. <laughs> we started off pretty strong. I'm gonna say we started off pretty strong, and then we took a little bit of a tumble. So, <laughs> 
It was inevitable for that to happen. We're going to have to go back and grab some more Explorer notes. I'm pretty sure there are some that we have missed over that way anyway. Uh, but yeah, guys. So if you find yourselves enjoying the video, don't forget to leave a like. Please, it means the world to me. Kick that YouTube algorithm in the ass because we're going to need it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, we're also going to try and uh, fancy up the editing on these ones a little bit. Try and chuck in a little bit of more memes and stuff like that for you guys. Make it a little bit more interesting, a little bit more different uh, camera angles and whatnot like that. Is this... Okay. Can we go on to here? Alright, this is news to me. I did not know that was a thing. Cool. Alright. Yeah, so we're going to try and fancy up the editing a little bit for you guys. Make it a little bit more... Not intense, but a little bit more... What's the right word? Interactive? No, that's, that's not the right word. Oh, there's a bunch of dillos here. Hello, dillos. Just ignore me. Pass them through. Just flying through. Okay. The thing that I'm really dreading is the water and food drain on this. Like, oh, yuck. Having our water drain so fast is just terrible. All right. Hello, parasaurs. There's another note down here we're going to grab. Where are you? I know you're around here somewhere. Sweet. Can we? Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Right, there we go. Sweet. All right, we're through. And I'm pretty sure here. Here it is. Hmm. That's strange. Alrighty, guys. Now, as far as I'm aware from what I can tell, it looks like we've got everything up and running. Di properly this time. Properly. Dinos are spawning in in the uh, level 5 increments up to 150. I haven't seen a 150 yet, but I have seen dinos that are spawning in with their level 5 increments, which is great. That's what we wanted to see. Uh, other than that, everything else seems to be okay so far. Uh, except for Explorer Notes, it doesn't seem that they've reset. Only some of them, uh, we can access, because we've accessed them before. We are playing on a single-player world. I was tempted to do a, a server for it, but I was like, eh, might as well just do it on the single-player. It's a little bit more annoying, and, like, time doesn't go while, uh, you jump off. But nonetheless, we can still make that work. So, yeah. Right now, we're just trying to get a bit of hide, get a few levels. You can see we've got 21 levels here. We're level 4 at the moment. We're going to pump stem up, and we're going to pump movement speed up. So, we're going to get started. We're going to get ourselves a couple of dodos. A couple of dead dodos right now, because, uh, yeah, we, we need some hide. We need to get started. Might as well capitalize on this, uh, this is a 4 times experience, quadruple XP. So, let's let's prod ourselves some dodo butt. Alrighty, guys. We've got a couple of spears now. We're ready to jab some dodos right up the butt. Level 10. What level are you? Are you a lower level? We'll kill the low level. Okay, wait, well, great. Spears break straight off the bat. All right, let's grab this juicy boy hide. Now, like I said, gathering uh, times three. There are a couple of things that are like pretty boosted. Like I think we've got crop growth speed times ten because uh, because we're in single player world, it won't be growing while we're offline. Uh, we're also running with the damage numbers on because I just like seeing the amounts of damage we do, so we can sort of tell how strong our dinos are and whatnot and it, uh, it gives us a good indication but uh yeah everything other than that is pretty much all vanilla like i said we're running no mods nothing like that so we're gonna we're gonna pray that everything goes pretty smoothly right now for today what i want to do is i want to try and get a tame i think in maybe like an iguanodon if we can get one, if we get enough berries, I don't know, uh, maybe even, actually, maybe not an Iguanodon, because that bastard is going to take so long to tame up, because uh, because we've got the taming set to times three, we don't really have, oh, this is just level five, I don't want to get him straight away, pretty damn close though, uh, yeah, because it's times three, we're gonna, it's going to take a hell of a long time to tame with berries, so I don't know if we'll go for an Iguanodon first, uh, we could go for like a Raptor or something, I'm not sure. Maybe a, a parasol sucker wouldn't be a good I would be a pretty good idea too, but I don't know if we'd get prime meat from anywhere. May I, I I definitely think we need to go for a herbie first. Stay away from the bloody seagulls because that bastard is gonna mess us up. Yeah, I think we'll go for a herbie first. So I think we might go for an iguanodon, maybe a parasol. I am not too sure. All of them take quite a bit of time to tame on berries. So we're going to have to pick our target pretty effectively and then we're going to have to work on getting bloody train carriers as well. That's another thing. Because actually in most shops would be pretty damn good right about now too. If we can find one. Uh, I'm pretty sure we'll, we've got a couple of further up ahead. I'm just going to grab a bit of hide here and there just to uh, just so we can make a couple of bowlers and whatnot. Level 20, 50, 70. Okay, we'll pick you first. And... Damn mate, booster. Dodos, just die mate. There we go. You're not doing anything for your friends except running away, so you might as well just die. Alright, sweet. 
He's dead. Let's go kill the rest of his friends. There's a Lystrosaurus over there. I guess we could tame up a Lystrosaurus. That's technically a first tame, right? Or even a Dodo. Actually, Dodo's not a bad idea. Just to get a couple of eggs going, but I think I'd do that once we have a base going. Or like at the shell of a base at least. At the very at the very minimum. Because uh these guys, they're not they're not the greatest uh when it comes to breeding and stuff like that. Alrighty, sweet. So we've got a bit of height. How much height have we got? We've got a couple of levels as well. Uh 119. We also hit up a wide drop, got a bed and a, some spark powder. Honestly, I'm gonna chuck it into stem right now. Alright, let's kill this Listro boy. Get some extra hide here. Thank you, mate. And uh, there's another explorer's note just up ahead as well. So we're going to capitalize on the area we are in. Head up there and uh, see if we can get a little bit more XP. Because you definitely want to try and stack explorer notes when you've got the uh, when you've got the four times buff. There's a Dillo over here. Do we want to try and take a Dillo? Oh, oh, oh. oh, it's only a level five. We can take him. Miss me, mate. Bring it on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, maybe we've got to be careful. I think this is our last spear, eh? There we go. Oh, he just copped that in the throat, mate. You're going to feel that one tomorrow. I'm going to quickly check something here. Is our camera shaking on? Camera shake scale? No. Okay. Just feels like our uh, camera is shaking a little bit more than it should be. But maybe that's just my imagination. All right. Let's kill another dodo here. Uh, we might as well. Extra XP. Extra hide. We're always going to need hide. You know what? We might not even tame up a dino this... This episode, we might just get a little bit of a shell going for our base. Uh, I have no idea where we want to set up first, but we are going to need the basic necessities. And boom, another level. Awesome. And more quadruple XP. I don't, I'm pretty sure the Explorer notes aren't supposed to be quadruple XP all the time. I'm not complaining. I will take it. But like, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to be that high. All right, what we might do, we might get a thatch uh, base sort of set up and going. Get a mortar and pestle down, get some uh, spoiled meat going and stuff like that. Because I think we're going to need it. So, we'll bring you guys back when we've got a little bit of a something set up. Alrighty guys, we've got a couple of uh, basic stuff crafted. We've got a bow. Oh, we didn't put our bloody bed down. Uh, we made a bit of a shell of a base. We've got a Sarko following us right now. I'm just trying to get away from him. And there's uh, also a wide drop over here. So I'm like, mm, let's hit it up, see what's inside. Hopefully we get some trank arrows and stuff. Because I just realized we literally have like five narco berries. And uh, we ain't going to be knocking out anything with those. So I've got to try and get some more. Uh, okay, it's some more thatch stuff. Wonderful. Not that we need that stuff. Uh, do we want to try and take that psycho on? I didn't see what level it was. We've got 40 arrows. We've got a dillo over here. Hey, big fella. How you doing? Be a shame if someone were to just straight out murder you, wouldn't it? Whoopsies. Accidents happen. All right. So, I know most shops spawn, like, up here, up this way somewhere. So, we're going to try and see if we can find a most shops to start off with. Uh, I kind of want to see what level this Sarko is, though. What level is he? Where'd he go? Because I'm pretty sure we can kill him for some primes. Some good old primes. But we are pretty low on food and water. We can outrun this guy, though. Come here, mate. He's level 25. I don't think we're going to try and take him on. We're not going to take him in in the water. Oh, we've just trapped ourselves. Oh, this is this is wonderful. Oh my god. Let's run this way. Oh my god. The Dukes, guys. Where'd he go? The poor Sarko. He just had his ankles broken on him. Damn, son. Where, where did he actually even go? Oh, who knows? Alright, sweet. So we're doing okay. We're still alive. Still kicking. We're gonna we're gonna head up, see if we can find some most shops, and uh see if we can get that. I probably should have run back and put the bed in the base, but uh well, well, we'll forget about that for now. Alrighty, guys. We found our first most chops. Level 10. I'm really hoping it just wants something basic. Don't go in the water, dude. No! Oh, he was about to walk in the ocean there. Let's give him a Mijo Berry. Hopefully, that's all you need. Oh, 90%. I swear. I'm really hoping it's like a Tinto Berry. I've got no raw fish meat. I've got nothing like that. So, I'm hoping it's like a Tinto Berry. One of the basic ones. And, uh, and then we'll have our first tame. There's another Dillo over here. Boom. And boomity boom. Easy. All right. We're going to wait for the most chops. Oh, please, dude. For all that sacred. Don't don't screw me around here. Just let me give you a Tinto Berry. Let me give you a Tinto Berry. Hurry up, mate. Hurry up. You got you to gotta hurry up here. We're, we're going to... We're starving. We're waiting to find out. You son of a bloody... Oh, rare flower. I don't have any rare flowers. But we did just find another level 60 and he wants a rare flower. <gasps> oh, why me? 
There's no way we're going to make it to the swamp and back in time. Oh, that's frustrating. I don't think we can get a. I don't think we can get a rare mushroom from anywhere else. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we need like the swamp for it. Oh, I'm gutted. If only, if only the bastard didn't sabotage us. If only it was a level five. Can you imagine our luck? I mean, it would have been level five, but I would have taken that bloody thing. All right, we're gonna take a quick wander around here. Nighttime is coming around, so I don't really like wandering around at night because you can't see squat. But uh, we're gonna see if we can find another most chops or, or something else. Or even if we just like literally just run around gathering narco berries. I will be okay with that because we need narco berries. Oh, great guys. And just what we needed as it's about to go dark. A freaking Seeger. Oh, that was, that was surprisingly easy. I was, I was about to get all triggered and rage out on this thing and uh, it just died. What do we need to fix that? Some thatch. Whew, I'm glad it didn't have the chance to steal anything from us, that's for sure. All right, we're going to grab that. We're also going to gamma up here just to make things a little bit easier so we can actually see what we're doing. Oh, bastard. Did you really just take my stone hatchet, you prick? Come on, I'm going to headshot you. Oh, another level 10, mate. I can't believe you stole our hatchet. Little shits. I hate the seagulls with a burning passion. I thought that was another one over there, the Bronto tail. Oh, wait, did they drop it again? Is it because I killed him? Oh well, I'm not bothering to pick it up. We just made a fresh one. So we split up a bunch of meat. We've got about 100 narco berries uh, to our name, which honestly is not as many as I would like. We could probably go for a trike. 100 narco berries is... I don't know what my maths is. Is it 10? 50? Yeah, 20. 20 narcotics. So we can get 20 narcotics from the, the 100 stack of... Of whatchamacallit, some narco berries. I don't know if we're going to bother to tame anything. We need to tame something. We, we have to tame something for the first episode. It's it's not going to be the first episode if we don't tame anything. So we're going to keep running around. We're going to... Th we're coming back to where we found those other most chops. I'm seeing if it's reset. I don't know. It's been a while since I've had to tame a most chops. Um, I don't think they do reset. I don't know. There's these damn seagulls everywhere that I just want to stay away from me. Okay, we got some... Semi good news. What are you running from, dude? What's over there? Is it a raptor? Something's attacked that poor iguanodon to a to an inch of its life. And what are we doing? We are running the complete direction that it came from. Because no fear. What is attacking it? Is it just a dillo? Damn. Okay. That's in that's intense. Feel for the little dude. Alright, there's some dillos down here. Uh, hello, good sir. I come bearing good presents and arrows and such. Oh, this is a tough boy. That was a complete miss. Just we'll just edit that out later. Alright, sweet. He's dead. Okay, our, uh, our buff is slowly starting to run out. So we're going to have to be a little bit better with what we do now. So we can, so we can get some few extra levels. Uh, did you reset, mate? Rare flower. You still want a rare flower. Damn. Oh, God! And there goes our buff. I think we found what was attacking that iguanodon, and it definitely wasn't that dillo. It was it was totally that raptor. Okay, I, I think we'll be right, because it's probably going to aggro on those trikes that were a little bit further down from us. And the trikes will definitely munch that dude in. Well, I mean, not munch, but kill that guy into next week. Where did we spawn at? Oh, we're all the way down here. Damn. This is going to be a hike back to our body, that's for sure. But uh, a little bit annoyed we lost the buff. But that is okay because what did we get? Level 42. So not a bad start. Not a bad start at all. And that is a bunch of floating jellyfish. That is totally normal. And you see that every day around here. Alrighty, guys. We are coming back up on our body now. It's just around the corner here. Uh, uh, I'm looking out for those trikes because I'm hoping... Yeah, it looks, it looks like they would have killed them because they're over there. They were over here previously. So we should be okay. Awesome. All right. So... There's the dead corpse. Alrighty, did it take out one of the trikes? If it did, that would be perfect. Never mind, it just brought them closer together. I was going to say, because I was in the process of making a campfire and, uh, and a mortar and pestle to go about making a bunch of stuff. But uh, it turns out that uh, the raptor had other plans and didn't want us to do that because it was just a very angry little boy. So we're going to just try and make a couple of trank arrows up to see if we can take one of these trikes. Maybe even a trap. We'll see how it goes. Alrighty guys, we are back. It is currently pissing down raining and it is foggy as hell. So we can't see squat. However, this level 20 trike here is very, uh, 
What's indulge? Indulge? No, that's not the right word. What's the right word? Enticing? Yeah. Very enticing to tame. So we've got 25 Trank Arrows, I think, we're making. 25? Yeah, 25 Trank Arrows. Level 20 female trike. We've got the stuff for a trap. Uh, because trikes like to do their little ramming thing. So we're going to chuck some traps down. Uh, or a trap. I'm hoping this is going to be big enough for it. Uh, I probably could have put it in a better position. Oh, no, this is all right, actually. And uh, hopefully we can get this guy knocked out. I'm praying. Why is it obstructed for? As if you were obstructed. Maybe we should run the S Plus mod, because goddamn. <laughs> this is going to be so annoying. Are you obstructed? I thought I heard battle music. I was freaking out for a second. All right, let's try picking it, doing it from this side, see if that's any better. Yeah, if we can get the trike over here, we should be able to do it. I've been hoping, I'm thinking it's just going to attack our structures, though, to be honest. Did it run away? Is it running away from us? Why is it running away from us? I don't think we've equipped our trank arrows yet. I don't know if it's running or if it's... Okay, that's... Strange. I don't understand why you're running for. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. No, don't go for the structure. Come for me. That's the wrong bow. That's the right bow. All right, where is he? Hey, big guy. Are you aggroed on our structures? Is that why? Oh, God. Run. Run. Okay, it's aggroed on that. I want to try and get it into the trap, though. It's only dealing 44 damage, which is fine. We just keep plocking it with Trank Arrows. Ouch! Oh, that friggin' hurt. All right, get in the trap over here. No, it's just gonna go right around it. Another uh, Mosh Chops spawned in as well, guys. So a level 10 one spawned in and uh, it wanted a Tinto Berry at first. We were so excited. It fed it the Tinto Berry and then it wanted the freaking Royal Prime Fish Meat. That one's gonna cop it in the head. It's not gonna be very effective because of the crest. But if it's enough to get the trike into the trap, I don't know why it's moving so slowly for. And right. Right at the last second, he decides to turn. Okay, we're just going to empty this. I don't know what's going on with this guy. I'm trying to keep his partner out of it, though, because there's one over there. I don't know why this guy isn't being aggressive. I am not complaining, though. If we can get this guy knocked out or this lady knocked out, we'll be cheering all the way home. I have no idea what is going on right now. Okay, easy. That was, uh, that was surprisingly a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. I don't know why we bothered making a trap for it when it just decided to do that. 145 to run it on as well. You know what? We're going to bowler this boy. Uh, let me get the bowlers out because we are high enough level for it. Can I craft a bowler? Bingo. If we can get a 145 Terra, that'd be sweet. We don't have any prime meat for it. We'll come to that at a later stage. No, don't you fly off, you bastard. Don't you? Oh, okay. He's kind of just stuck straight on top of the trike. Do I... Do I capitalize on this, guys? I don't know. This is going to risk it, isn't it? Yeah, I probably should have bolted it. Probs should have bolted it. Okay, well, that's flying out of here. I don't think it's going to come any closer to the ground than uh, what it currently is. It's flying out to sea. It might possibly come back, but what we're going to do while we wait for it to come back... And for that trike to get a little bit hungry, we are going to... That's an ocean drop. We are not going to bother going for that. Never mind. You want to come back, mate? I have I have candy and a nice dark van for you to hop into. You sure you don't want to come back? Nonetheless, I'm glad we've got the trike knocked out, which is pretty good. Great start to the first episode. It only took us freaking, I think, like two hours. We've been trying to get, <laughs> trying to get our first tame. Um, oh, did we already put food in its inventory? We have. It's already at 9% actually. That's pretty That's pretty good. Okay, this is our tr Pteranodon from before. I'm going to... We're going to we're gonna YOLO this. Oh yeah, awesome. Okay. Let's pull the right bow out. 145. It is a male, but that's okay. We're just going to keep emptying arrows into it. Oh! Ah, crap. We accidentally hit it. Damn it! Uh, you know what? That's fine. I'll take a 145 that's been hit once over a no 45. So that's great for us. All right. Just like that, we've already got two teams knocked out. They should be okay-ish to tame. So we'll uh, we'll bring you guys back when they're tamed up. 
Hopefully it doesn't take a year and a half to tame up, but uh, we'll see how we go. I'm gonna check this level on this Tyranodon too. Level 25. Never mind. Okay guys, we we're out hunting down some uh, prime meat and we've just found a raptor here. Attacking a poor little Listro. We're gonna bowler it. Oh, that was terrifying. It's level 20, we're gonna knock it out. It is only level 20, but when you're this low level and you're just starting out, you'll take what you can get. All right, sweet. Got a raptor. Now, I was actually heading over here because if you guys remember, there was that Sarko. So I'm coming over here to see if we can get some prime meat off it to feed our Pteranodon boy. See how we go. Uh, he should be just here. There he is. Hey, mate. We should be able to just pretty much walk backwards from him. Granted, if we have enough arrows, that's going to be the main thing. And if he's low enough level. I don't know what level he was. But you want to sit right there for me. I'm just going to check the area. Make sure there's not another Sarko. And this is not the right... This is the wrong one. Make sure. What level were you, big dude? Oh, oh, he's moving now. He's got the zoomies. Come on, mate. Don't run away from me. Just die like the good boy Sarko that you are. I probably could have tamed this guy too, to be honest. Level 25. I'll take it. Uh, he's got some arrows on him. He's got some trank arrows. I'm actually going to start gathering the Sarko skin. And we'll take the berries as well. We're going to use our... I can't remember if Sarko's gift prime or not. Yep, there it is. There's one prime. Can we get another one from you? One more, mate. All I'm asking for. One more. Come on. Come on. One more. Is he going to get it? We're not... Oh, we got two. I'll take it. Three. Oh, come on. You're giving us quite a lot of meat. All right. Two prime meat. I will take that. We're going to... We sh probably should have starved our Tyranodon a little bit more. But uh, we didn't do that. I could probably give some to the Raptor. Actually, you know what? No, we'll just give it standard raw. Oh, stay away from the seagulls before the slimy bastards take it. Let's get back to the Tyranodon, give it some prime meat. And uh, we'll load up the Raptor while we're going past it as well. Hey, mate, how you doing? Here's your meat. Enjoy. And maybe I should bump up the spoiling time as well. Because uh, the prime meat is already spoiling. And uh, yeah, we don't have a stacking mod or anything like that. So nothing's stacking. It's all vanilla. So a bit of a, an extra challenge for us. Consider it. Consider, uh, what's the right word? Uh, in comparison to how like we normally play. So that's got six minutes. So good. He's coming up for another feed now. He's at 3%. Uh, yeah, he did cop that extra hit on the way down. But he's still got the extra 64 levels. That prime should give him a little bit of an extra boost. Let's take a look at the trikey. Oh, actually, it's what we need to do. We need to make a tribe. Oh, we already have a tribe. Tribe member. Leave tribe. Okay, cool. Tribe of CJ. We've got to come up with something like that. CJ is a zester. Can we not? Oh, that's why. CJ the Zesty. Ah, that's better. Oh, yeah. Give me some of that spiciness. All right, done. So now we can see if everything will tame up and whatnot. How are you looking, big dude? 42%. We shouldn't need narco berries on this guy. Just for good measures, I'm going to give him three, though. Just to make sure. All right, sweet. So, tames are looking good. We are looking good. Uh, we don't really have a base, but that doesn't matter. We've got a bunch of tames coming up soon. So, we're going to wait for these guys to tame up. Alrighty, guys, and we are back. And look at this beauty that we have. Nice level 29 trike. I uh, don't mind if I do. Now, uh, we may have got slightly complacent and gone and had dinner and uh, forgot about our uh, Pteranodon. And uh, he may or may not have woken up and flown away. Yeah, uh, so we definitely did not tame up that Pteranodon, but we did get this beautiful trike, which is going to make our life hell of a lot easier. And uh, there's the Pteranodon flapping away in the distance over there. And we also got that raptor, as you saw from the tribe logs. But uh, that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video, guys. Uh, I think today was a good first episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. It's uh, just back to the roots of Basic Arc. So hopefully, we can provide some entertainment for you guys. But uh, yeah, thanks very much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more. But other than that, guys, I will catch you in the next one.